Hey guys, uh, today I'm going to show you how you can fix the iPhone 4S problem where uh, when you go into your settings and you try to turn on the Wi-Fi and it just won't work. Now this is, uh, this is a common issue on the iPhone 4S, especially when you uh, update it to iOS uh, 7, which was the new update. Uh, so here I have an iPhone 4S and uh, I'm going to show you guys that the Wi-Fi does not work. Now as you can see here there's no service whatsoever. I'm going to go into the App Store and as you can see this phone is not activated. So pretty much this phone is useless without any Wi-Fi. So I'm going to go into settings and show you guys that this phone uh, doesn't have any Wi-Fi. <laughs> I don't know why it's taking so long. Okay, there we go. And just to prove to you guys that this is a 4S, I'm going to hold Siri their Siri. Okay, so uh, we're going to go into Wi-Fi. And right here, as you can see, it's kind of grayed out. And whenever I try to uh, turn it on, it won't let me. Now, Bluetooth uh, works, but I don't know why the Wi-Fi doesn't work. Uh, if I go into, if I do this, the Wi-Fi doesn't work here either. Now the phone just freezes here, and it pop a message. Yeah, there we go. Uh, yeah. Okay, let me see. Yeah, it's it doesn't work. So I uh, came up with a solution. Now, as you can, right here, I have another 4S. Now this is a. Uh, a damaged 4S and as you can see here it says BMW because this was originally from BMW but anyways uh, I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys that this one does have Wi-Fi as you can see here uh, the Wi-Fi works no problem whatsoever now both of these phones were purchased at the same time uh, and on the same date now I don't really know why um, this one doesn't have any Wi-Fi so I looked up on uh, Google on how to fix it and it, I, I actually came up with a solution it's very very simple uh, so what you do is you take a heat dryer and you place it right on top of uh, uh, this speaker right here okay uh, near the camera and once you do that uh, the phone is gonna come up with a message and it's gonna say that it's too hot and I'm going to demonstrate that uh, in a second here. But uh, what you do is, uh, once that message pops up, uh, you go ahead and turn off your phone and uh, it should reset. And the Wi-Fi should work. Okay guys, so step one, um, go ahead and place the heat dryer right on top of your uh, speaker here. And just kind of... Um, keep it there don't wiggle it around like I did here I made a mistake here and uh, did that but uh, make sure it's just on the speaker okay guys so after the phone comes up with a message that says iPhone is too hot or it needs to cool down go ahead and power it down immediately and put it in a Ziploc and go ahead and place it in your fridge now place it in your fridge for about five to ten minutes okay so note that you need to power down your device so that this could work now I made a mistake and when I first tried this I didn't power down my uh, 4s and I just put it in the fridge and it didn't work so make sure after the message comes up that it says iPhone is uh, too hot go ahead and immediately just power it down and put it into your fridge Okay guys, so after you uh, take it out of your fridge and it's all uh, cooled down, uh, go ahead and power it up and uh, it, should take, uh, it should take some time when it's powering up, but it'll be all good after it's finished. So um, as you can see here, the phone just booted up and I'm going to go ahead and go into settings and I'm going to go into Wi-Fi and as you can see here, the... Uh, option is now uh, on okay guys so if this didn't work for you be sure to contact me on YouTube or just post a comment in the description below and I will try and help you out so if you guys enjoy the video and I 
if I uh, helped you out today, be sure to comment, like, and subscribe. It would help me out so much. And I hope to see you guys later. Peace.